السلام علیکم ہیلو ویورس ویلکم ٹو مائی چینل بینکنگ لرننگ اینڈ فارن ایکسچینج انٹرنیشنل فائنانس اینڈ ٹریڈ آئی ایم یور مختار احمد خان کنٹینیوٹی ٹو دا ایکٹیویٹی ان دا امپورٹ ڈپارٹمنٹ This is my 89th session, Retirement and Lodgement of Import Bill into PID and handing over to customer. Before I go to the main video, I would like to request you, all of you, to please press the bell button for subscription and watch complete this video to learn complete retirement and lodgement of the import bills of the import department and comment comment me you like or dislike and what is shortfall or shortcomings in the video please do comment and send me your advice regarding import of bill okay and please once again request to please push the or press the button for subscription this is my earliest request and every time i forget to remind you to please subscribe my channel okay when the documents he reached to the exporting bank or exporter bank to advise the lc to the exporter when they receive the documents they will scrutiny and verify strictly according to letter of credit matching all documents with the lc term and after satisfaction the exporting bank operating abroad they can make payment to the customer after negotiation or scrutiny of the bill as per lc term if it is advised and the lc for reimbursement otherwise within 7 days they may claim to us or they may debit our account after 7 days our set after proper certification that they found all documents are in order this is their end this is exporting bank activity when everything received in order according to the ilc term they wrap the documents packet the documents and hand over to the courier these documents may again repeat you to learn you people because you forget sometime bill of lading bill of exchange packing list weight list consular certificate certificate of origin insurance cover note or insurance as per their importer request With all documents they send through courier to me or the importing bank suppose i am sitting in the import department and we are acting as a importer bank so all document will reach to us and they come from through courier dhl or any fedex fedex or the courier company hand over to the documents our counter we receive the documents acknowledge the documents and stamp the document properly date time and name of the person who received the documents okay this is the our counter and that import department what they will do is that these documents they will try to inform to the customer we have received your documents import bill of 10000 dollar from bank of america or bank of canada or bank of tokyo we have received your bill your documents come to us 
and retire the documents and make the payment of $10,000. If you have already obtained $10,000 in the margin, 100% margin retained from the importer, your customer, you may lodge the document in the PAD, payment against document. This head is operative in all the local bank and in Pakistani bank and Indian banks. And I don't know what type of head they, the foreign bank, open for this purpose. Okay. And with a reasonable period, that is seven days as per UCP 500 or 600, whatever is in the market, International Chamber of Commerce given the instruction the seven days after receiving. And within seven days, you have to scrutiny and we have to lodge and we have to retire the documents, make the payment to the exporting bank. If you not instructed the bank for payment or is reimbursement the payment. So if, the, if they assume the foreign bank assume the documents are in order and they will debit your account, our account, Nostro account with them. Debit and make payment to the exporter if the documents are in order and certificate given to the opening bank. We are the opening bank, we are the establishing bank, we are the importer bank, UBL or Habib bank or any bank in Pakistan we supposed to be act as an importer bank. Okay. When the customer comes to us and adjust the whole 10,000 amount either margin, certain margin, 40, 60, 100 percent margin, we will debit the margin, we will and we will debit the PID and credit to foreign bank. We credit the Bank of America or Bank of Tokyo, Bank of Japan, Bank of Mitsubishi, Bank of China, we credit the foreign bank. Debit the PID, payment tax document for, for lodgement, this is a lodgement entry pass at our counter. Okay, this is the process in the import counter. When we make payment through SWIFT or through any other tax or any other method, the settlement made between PAD. If the again, our duty is very much important that we scrutiny, we verify the documents properly at our counter. Documents are in order according to LC term. The copy of the LC, the LC file, you will match the documents whether you are receiving the documents according to the letter of credit or not. This is your or this is my responsibility and the dealing person who is the import department. Okay? Here is clear that your importer bank is watching you and watching you and watching you and safeguarding you. Otherwise, if the importer, if the importer has not said that I will not receive this flow, this is a flow, this is a discrepancy, so you will be in trouble. Therefore, within seven days, within two days, within three days, there is enough time, seven days, to match the documents according to the letter of credit or the documentary credit. Whether you are receiving the documents, all bill, all documents mentioned in the letter of credit, IB8, an application of the letter of credit. This is your duty or this is my duty being a import manager or imports section. Okay. This is the lodgement and retirement process. If the documents are ready and order and the customer ready to lodge the documents and accept the documents, you take a simple letter, we have accepted the documents, they will lodge and then you will retire the document and hand over the all documents to the importer to release the goods from port, from shipping company. Okay. These all are my, all my knowledge, I kept in my knowledge and remember, fortunately, 38 or 35 years ago, 1988, 
I completed my foreign exchange course with the help of Mr. Watson. Is Mr. Alexander Watson? He is my mentor or my teacher, and I read all the all. I keep the his book with me. Still now I I have the recommend a, a book. International Trade and Finance. This is the book. You can see this book. Finance to International Trade. Mr. Watson. I don't know whether he is alive or not. He is. He was at that time at age 89, member of Institute of Bengal, UK. I all knowledge got from this book. and thanks the almighty allah still i am remember many things when i i deliver the lecture to you people i must have the knowledge from this book and then i deliver the lecture okay thank you very much now the retirement and lodgement is clear at our counter union and the customer will take the documents it is charged in the back of the bill of lading delivered to the order of messrs so and so x y z and company he will because the bill of lading is made in our favor the important what you learned so far you received bill of lading number 1 bill of exchange number 2 bill packing list number 3 weight list 4 number 4 number 5 consular certificate number 6 certificate of origin consular certificate blacklist these are documents which are demanded by the importer if importer don't demand these documents you don't have to mention all these thing to save what of the customer or the importer we all deliver the we all write or we noting on the letter of credit that following documents are required must be required within sir within the stipulated period okay gentlemen try to remember me comment my lecture you understand next session will be export department and we start from exporting on the export counter now i am in the import counter i am sitting in the as import manager in the bank acting for the or acting for the importer and next time when i come to you for export department therefore please remember me in your and comment me if anything goes wrong or i could not explain you properly i must clear one thing i am a local who is speaking english is not like my, my language i am trying to impart you people because i read all this terminology in english and that is why mai isko english mein deliver kar raha hu aur urdu bolne wale bhi samajh rahe hain so translate kar le koi problem ho to mujhe mere whatsapp number pe mere gmail pe aap kar sakte hain aur comment likh sakte hain इसमें कमेंट करें कमेंट बहुत जरूरी है आप लोग कमेंट भी नहीं देते हैं लाइक भी नहीं करते हैं चलिए ठीक है डिसलाइक लाइक तो आपकी मर्जी है लेकिन ट्राई टू स्पेयर सम टाइम फॉर मी आई एम ए सीनियर पर्सन एंड टू फ्रॉम लास्ट टू इयर्स आई एम इम्पार्टिंग यू पीपल एंड शेयरिंग माई नॉलेज टू यू पीपल टू ग्रो योर नॉलेज द पीपल हु आर अटैच विद द बैंकिंग सेक्टर हु आर वॉन्टेड टू आर हु आर इंक्लाइन टू रिमेन इन द बैंक they will be beneficial from my lecture and they will learn from this video thank you very much so nice of you for the office and subscribe me thank you very much